Okay, welcome back. Um, this is part three of what we've been um, working on on our city of North Highlands. Um, as of so far, we have both our coal mines and um, our coal mine and our raw ore mine. And we have our one uh, smoldering factory. Our city halls a level three, which is really cool. So we got that really up there. Excuse me, sorry. I had dinner just not too long ago, so I'm drinking my wife's drink, so you, if you hear a little pause, that's me trying to make sure that I don't make too much of a ruckus on um, on this recording, let alone it's being um, streamed live through um, twitch.tv. Um, I am a member of that, and so I made sure that it's going to be on there, so don't worry. I will try to, I need to remember to um, put my recordings on there so that way they can be constantly viewed. Um, but they are on YouTube.com. So that way everybody knows that I'm, uh, of what is going on with the game. Alright, so again, here we are. Here's our wonderful city. And it looks like, well, you know what? Let's see if we can straighten this up just a little bit more. Uh, oh, well. It's better than nothing. Um, we got pretty much, oh, we also have our water in, and we have our sewage treatment plant in. So we got all that in. So this is pretty much what we geared it up to. So we're going to first, we're going to speed this thing up by pressing three. So that way we can start rocking in the the dough here. Let's see. We, oh, they're closed. I guess they need some people. We need to get some people in there. So, let's see here. We're rocking with $37,000 in the bank, and the high school is a whopping sixty grand. So, we need approximately about $23,000 more. We'll make that 21000 We just got our... Um, early um, pay increase or, or I should say the city's paycheck oh look we're getting closer uh, so let's go ahead and get ready to get this bike this thing in here this is going to help us grow oh we got 9350 and we need to put one more in so where are we on now Perfect. All right. Now that that's maxed where we want it, because it needs to be at 500, we should be a-okay with that. We should be getting some more people in here. Now, this is um, what we could do. We could upgrade this avenue right here all the way to this to where we could have it, and we could have that and. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's upgrade that avenue. So that way we can have that up up to par with the rest, how the rest of the city looks. Now, the next level after this is a streetcar avenue. You can put that in if you wish. But that's up to you. Me the way the way just the way we have this is just good enough because you're, you're not gonna do too much with this and well we're gonna just basically this is what we're gonna do we're gonna just upgrade all of it all the way around just to be on the safe side because we are getting a lot of money There. Now that, that that avenue is done, we should be able to handle everything else. We have eight grand left. That's no problem. Everything is at its max. So that should relieve a lot of stress on us. So, which is really good. Well, that one needs to be upgraded too. So, 
least upgrade this bridge over here, make it look like the other one. Oh, that one's 10,000. We're halfway there. is now upgraded. We're still closed. And we're closed there, and that's not good. We got 16,000 people, and we don't know what to do with them. That's good that we have nothing to bulldoze, because it means everything's doing what they're supposed to be doing. question is, is what's going on? He was just letting me know that we can have um, what is known as a tra um, trade headquarters, which we are planning on putting in. Um, we'll probably most likely put it in where this wonderful um, ore mine is once we take it out, because pretty soon we are going to be importing our um, our um, coal mine, coal and also ore. So don't, so we should not worry about that. Okay, we need eighteen thousand to get our wonderful thing in, and it's still not ready yet. We're still sitting at three fifty. Students are coming in. Well, remember, we need about five. We need only five hundred. So, to um, put that high school in, which we are going to be putting in. Now, we do not have to upgrade the high school. That means we don't have to put more classrooms or um, the gym in to get the next level. It, um, Let me see here. Yeah, because with the elementary school and the high school alone, that would put us over 800, which would be fine. And so... And if you can tell, we are actually making a lot of money. No, actually, I should say we are putting in a lot of money. 107 kit, 105 kids to go. Oh, make that 40 more kids to go. There we go. Now we're getting some. We're looks like we're really. Oh, not another one. Where is he? Oh, I'm not going to worry about him. We got it, people. We have the high school. So we're going to go ahead and plant this guy in. If we can.
but I think that's where we're going to have to put it. Look, he's eating our trash. Cool. didn't last long did it well it looks like we're making money again yeah I know we're in deficit spending but hey it happens we're still hiring there we're working there we need to get this going so Let's see here. Well, what we could do is go ahead and build our other smoldering division um, uh, plant and see if that will help um, kickstart the, the industry because that's what we're going to need to do. We need to get this going. Do that. Let's just hope it doesn't take us long to build it like it took the first one, but who knows what happens. And we're 12,000 away from that. Can't do anything about it until we get money coming in. And we need to get people coming into the city. And we can't do much. But there might be a little trick I can pull. If you go into your fire department, you'll see this blue building. If This is if you have the progressive um, pack. Okay, put it right next to the entrance to your city. It will help you out. I recommend that you max it out as much as you can. So that way, um, it will um, service the whole city and they and it makes it a lot easier. And so, and it also does make the people a lot happier. Just to let you know. Oh, that's not too bad. Mm, still don't like it. So, let's see here. That's where it should be. But we don't have the funds. We need the funds. So, um, today I was watching some um, Sim City videos and how people were doing t like their own regions and everything and trying to make get the most out of their region. I'm like, how can you guys do stuff like that, you know, without using cheats and getting tired of the same region so much? And because it's like, you know, this takes a lot out of you. And I'm serious, it really does. And, and a lot of people don't get that. And so... And 
dude, so... If you need people, you need people, and now you need people. Oh, this is gonna take... This is gonna be lovely. And we need water as well. And the water for this is like sixty thousand. It's like it's twenty thousand more than for the treatment plant um, silos. The one just one silo for the water pumping st uh, station is sixty thousand dollars and it, this is no joke This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna bond ourselves out, do the fifty thousand dollar bonds. That's gonna help us out in the long run. Yeah, it's gonna kind of hurt us, but it is gonna help us out to make sure that we can get things done because we have to get a lot of this done. Okay, that one's done, and they're saying they need more power. Man, we're in the negative in the power. And let's put one more in just to the safe side. Alright, that should help us for a while. We have 134 uh, me megawatts going. And at least that we won't die from a nuclear blast. Trust me, I put a nuclear power plant in my um, in a city like this before. And it blew up. Literally, it just blew up on me. And I'm like, ah, no! <laughs> And so, I'm like, what do I do now with no freaking um, way to get things done? There we go. I guess we just needed some power. It was the power that was out. Okay, we got our community college now. So, we're going to put our community college... See if we can put our community college in. And that should be right here. We can put our community college right here. Or if we want, we can put it in right here and put homes in that one. I think that would be the better choice to do. We just don't have the funds right now. Now... Okay, so, um, let's see what they're asking here. Uh, they want a gym. And ask me later on that. And they're probably asking, no kid. Okay, little classes. Add classrooms. Yeah, they've already been added. Yeah, we've already got that, so we're going to go ahead and just cancel that, because we've been putting those in pretty well. Alright. We're going to put our college right here. That's going to get all this, all these people right here happy. And we're going to put some homes probably right in this, so that way, you know, separate the schools as much as possible. <laughs> Now, we now have 19,000. We have to get to 30,000 to get to the fourth level. So we're doing great. 
And the fourth level, we're going to put in our safeties department because we have to make sure we can get safety department people into the region to help us out and get that all going. <clears throat> Excuse me. And so, you're so hiring, you're processing. What's our yeah, thirty-five ninety-nine. Okay, so the market went down on that. What about you? Yeah, the market went up on you. And the market's up on you. Alright, cool. So we're getting some good dough out of all of this. Alright, now our next phase to do on this. Once um, we get that college in here and we start getting everything really going, it's going to be this, the processing, the processor plant right here. We're going to put two of these in. If you can tell, we first we have to have make sure we have medium or high um, tech industry, industrial buildings, but we have to have five of them. So, which is fine. We can do it because we have like seven spots, which would be, which is nice. So we can really make that grow. Um, so, and right now we only have 50,000, so we can't do much, but this guy, and we're at 1157, we're almost, we got it, and we're going to have to wait until next year, next day, to see if we break the 1200, because that's what we need, and it looks like, yep, we can now officially upgrade our place our wonderful mayor's um city how um city hall man i cannot speak today okay so we're going to do the department of safety and we're going to put it on top of our department of utilities so that way they're all together so now if you look at it it looks kind of neat how we have the roofing okay you got the roofing of right here for that and then Here's the roofing for the city hall. Now, the next time we can put anything in is when we hit 75,000 residents. Right now, we're at 31,290. So we got a long ways to go. We have over 40,000 people to get into this city. But we're not going to worry about that because the city is already growing. You see all these nice tall buildings coming in? We want these. And I'm serious. This is what we want. And... Let's see what these guys are saying. We are going to put it in. Trust me. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, we got that taken care of. Now. Okay, it looks like we've got the Department of Safety approved for the um, to share for the whole entire region which is nice we didn't have to have that come up but that's still nice to know and it looks like we're doing pretty good on our rent on our income revenue now we're still waiting for um, the next day of um, so we can see what we can do with the university because the university is what we're going to put in next the university is 88,000 we have 105 right now we want to keep, have that keep on going up. And so we're now at 136. So look at that. So we got all these right here. Now, the other thing I saw out of the, out of the um, other, other one, everybody else, is they had their taxes really up. I don't believe in having high taxes. I believe of having, um, what is it? Um, low taxes to see if you can... Um, um, what you can do by all means make sure you are, um, your coverage is turned on because quite frankly it will turn itself off if you don't have the funds for your um, progressive so for progressive make sure you have your your stuff turned on so that way you're not going to be left out of a loop um, And with school about to start, here we go. 
We have 1157. We need to get to 1200. And right now, um, we have 1157 of 1238 students. So we have 1157 students enrolled. And we have 31,000 people living in our wonderful city, which is good. And so we're going to put this right here. We have 90 so far. To update this quicker, just slide off and slide right back on. And see, now we're at 205. We have less than 1,000 to go. Slide in and slide out. You know, I'm going to do this periodically and see how everything's running. We got one, two. We got some good, some nice buildings. We got another one coming in right here. Where are we at? at 405. Good. Five eleven, less than seven hundred. Okay, we need five hundred people now. me later and get on that. 850. 891. So like, like I said, all this right here is mostly nothing but residential. Besides like right here, you know, we got some, our, our safety department people. Where are we at? We're at 11.30. Let's see if we can break this 11.57. We're still at 11.30. <laughs> there it is. We now have it. And so we're going to come on over here. Okay, this is what I recommend. Okay, find the most flat spot. Okay, you see how flat that is right there? The reason why is because of the way it's placed in. Bring it in. A, actually, no. I like, I like trying to... There we go. To um, match it up with the... With the... Um, the light poles. It makes it a lot easier. So it's like right there. That's actually the best spot to put it. So we plop it in right there. Now, if you get your um, road, put it right in front of it. And then, because we're going to actually fix this road right here anyways. We're going to stretch this all the way over. don't like how that is actually going. We're gonna do that. And reinsert this. That's better. Now, you see how straight that is? It's not all choppy the way I thought it was gonna be. Then, what you do is go over here, you know, curve this road right here instead of having a, um, intersection curve it and that's not how I wanted to do that so this is a nice little curve right here now this one right here that's actually really really awful so we're gonna fix this all right yeah that's fine All right, and we're saying they're saying that we need to add on to our treatment plant here. It looks like we need to right there. Give me one more. There. Now that's how you fill that up. Now. Let's check out our... Okay, see, now, we got a high-tech right here. We got a population boom for our city, which is good. 
Here, I'm going to show this to you. Okay, this is all your achievements. Okay, you can tell some of the top ones we don't have any achievements for. But, um, Uh, we are filling these this up as we go. So it's like we got some purple, some yellows, and we got a brown one. And so, and you know that it's just our achievements. And you know, having achievements is actually really, really good to have. Okay, this one is kind of a fun one. I wish they did this before. Because this one causes fires <laughs> in your city. And so you've got to watch it. So the less fires you have, the better. Let's see what happens here. Looks like the building across the street is caught on fire now. The rain's gonna help. How many more errors do we have left on this? Three. If you ever want to have like parts of your city be done, just do just do the fireworks at the um, fire station. It will help you out. Oh, like right there, there's another one. There's two more hours left. Looks like um, we can get a new mayor's house going. Okay, that one's kind of far away. This probably won't react to it. And we did it. We had less than five hour, five fires an hour, and that's what counts. So we got $50,000 to put on our bank. And that was it. And that's how you take care of that business. Now if you can tell, we're getting some of these tall buildings in here. That's what we want. It raises our revenue. We are now less than 20000 away from the, our, our, fifth, our fifth growth. But... Let's find something out real fast. Let's go back down to here. We're gonna go here. We have, it says one medium. Now, we're not really done with this over here. What I actually recommend, this is where it gets really fun. If you really wanna have a lot of fun with this type of a map, go back, go into your roads. What are we, what are we saying here? Oh, we can have our mayor's mansion. Don't worry about it, you don't really, with this map, you really, you really can't put it in. But anyways, go go in. Keep this on curve because it makes it a lot easier for your your to put in the bridges. Because if you can tell, the bridges are going to help you out, especially when it comes to your trade. The trade commission works a lot better when you have a bunch of bridges. This is the one thing he didn't do. 
And for right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to try to see if I can get most of this in. Alright, now, this is where it gets a little bit difficult. Okay, so that needs to go. So this bridge right here. Because we need to, what we need to do is we need to make sure that the road from the university is in first. Let's bone this thing. Okay, that's not what we want. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. You just have to play with it for a bit. And see where it would work. Ew. That's not what we want. Let's see if we can curve this, this thing. See how I'm curving it? That should work a little bit better. So let's put this bridge back in. That should work. Yeah, there we go. Now with this one, stretch it all the way out. Whoop. Make that a little bit so that way we know. Yeah, you're going to put like a lot of stops on this. Don't worry about it. It's not going to really matter. Now, this last bridge, you want it to match up here or down there. And it sounds like my daughter is up. Oh, well. <laughs> there. You see how that is going to go right on through? That's what you want. Stick that right there. Now, now that we have that done, now what we can do is we can put residential in here. We can put residential in here. We can put the up. Oh, we can put in a lot of things, and that's what we want to do. And but first, what you want to do is this: put in the dorms, dorm this thing out. Because, quite frankly, it is worth it to do it this way. Okay, you see? You see what I did? That's what you want to do. You do that, you're great. Then, take your residential. Take the air of that. Take care of all that. So, basically, wherever this university is, that's where you want to put residential. This is the most critical one. Put <coughs> that just the way it is. And then do it or across the street. So all this right here is all residential. It's going to grow this area like crazy. And that's what you want to do. Now, if you look at our, um, at our dump, yeah, we got a couple of these full. We're going to destroy this whole entire thing. We're going to move it. We're going to have a paralleled. Um, we're going to have it go um, right in, like, make it look like it's going right into the ocean. But the thing is, we're going to cut some of these out so we don't need them. And that's the thing. We're going to take out the road over here. We're going to move this such in a way that it's going to look a lot better. And this is where you want to, um, and I'm serious, this is where you really want to, like, um, Put the thing on slow so that way it doesn't hurt your um, hurt the citizens 
and it's make the ha making your city smell like there's no tomorrow. And so it makes it a lot easier. Let's, but before we do, let's check out our. It said we ain't, we needed to put another one in. So yeah, we can now have 40 rooms. So we we got that taken care of. So it's like all this, if you can tell, it's all growing. It's perfect. We're at 69,000. We have less than um, 6,000 to go to get that going. Now, let's go check what our, how many we have. It says we now have two. And so, there they are. There's one here, and one and one's right here. We just need to get a little bit more. So, we just need to get a couple more, get that get, um, going up. And we should be fine. We're now at 70,000. And like I said, this city is growing the way you want it to. Now, you can always start a project with, this, with your university. You don't have to. But this is what we are going to do. We're going to go over here. We're going to go ahead and take care of our wonderful dump. Take it all the way out. I mean, it's, uh, everything that you've done, take it all out. So it's like, <coughs> excuse me. So that way, and then on top of that, when you do, when you bring this, when you bring this back on, you want to make sure sure that you give the residential some room. And I'm not kidding. If you don't give them room, they can't expand to the buildings that you want them to. So right, right here is the best spot. And so... Now, we're just going to put in like a couple of these, so we're, that will help us out. Because what we're going to do is we're going to put the furnace in. And we're going to leave that right there. Now, when I usually put these in, I usually skip a couple. To get, you know, to give it some room. So that that's all you need. Boom. That's all. Grab these furnaces. And put, furnace this thing out. should do that should give us enough that's eight and we can get this resuming again on fast speed now let's go ahead and take this road out because we don't need it anymore because this is where you're going to put your big trade building um trade port that's where you want to put it and so and that's what we did we just basically moved this on over with the trade port and everything we're going in right over here because we're also going to take out this road right here and we're going to put a railroad right in here and that's going to really really help out as well Oh, they want us to be break a garbage pickup record. Let's see how far, how many we can do. Forty-six thousand seven hundred twenty tons of garbage is what we picked up so far. Let's see, we're right now at nineteen. So I'm watching this thing grow, So, and I have it in such a way that you can see this as well. We're almost halfway there. 
Oh, we just broke halfway point. So let's see. Let's see if we can get this reward here. We have 18,000 to go. Seventeen thousand. Fifteen thousand. Sixteen thousand. Twelve thousand. Eleven thousand. We're sitting at eleven thousand right now. <laughs> it looks like we're getting a new um, factory. It looks like a high density one. We're at 10,000. Ah. Uh, ears bothering me. We're holding fast at 36,000 tons. Oh, because we maxed out at 44,016 garbage cans collected. So, let's see if we can beat that record in the next following day. Now, it looks like we're getting good with our um, processors. Let's see what we're doing here. Okay, yeah, we have two mediums and a and a high. So this is our high, these are our mediums. Here's another medium, that's three mediums. So we need two more mediums or four more um, high level, um, uh, what is it? high level, uh, high in, um, industrial plants. Okay, and these have to be high tech types. There we go. And so, and it looks like we got a fourth one coming in, so let's see. Yep, we're at four. We're almost there. We need one more now. So it, yeah, it takes a little time, but you can, we can get it there. And we, if you can tell, we're almost at seventy-five thousand. Still sitting on four, four one right now, and it looks like we're going to have a nice size building coming right there. Right, but um, people are dying all around us. Ah, no wonder. Our police department's really well, so that's not going to hurt us. 